you know, my boss is here, and my boss is boss is here, and my boss is boss is boss is here. <laughs> and I just told him about my cannabis habit. And I'm still back on about it. Anyway, what the fuck are we talking about? <laughs> right. Yeah, I don't know, yeah, I check my own tunes like we sort of complete crap. And uh, well, I was with my ex-girlfriend, and um, I like to have music on when, you know, I come into well, sex, you know, I like, I like to put a bit of music in the background, but one night I put it on uh, shuffle, and then we were in the midst of the right moment, and then all of a sudden, the duck tail was being tuned, you know, okay? okay, so I panicked, I panicked, I didn't know what to do, because I had two choices really, it was one, address the fact that it was on, and then just like laughing and work through it, or ignore it and carry on. So I ignored it. All I remember from that night is, life is like a hurricane here in Duckburg. Race cars, lasers, aeroplanes, it's a duck blur. Might solve a mystery, or rewrite history, the duck tails, a roo, and then I came. And then that's the government advertising for you. You know it's on the uh, cigarette packets over the past a couple of years and to start doing the, the pictures of them. And to me, it pisses me off because it's just showing you the worst case in a scenario. And it doesn't give you that picture for any other product in the world. Like, if I, if I bought a Cadbury's or Dairy Milk, right, and there was a picture of the fattest man in the world, <laughs> spinning out of his tail, smearing his own shit, that's the worst case scenario. <laughs> if, on my kind of carbon, there was a picture of me getting spit roasted out by the Chuckle Brothers. <laughs> that's the worst case scenario. Thank you, I'll be James Beckett. Thank you.